broadcast live. Beast, how you doing, man? Good, man. How are yeah, you? Yeah, it's nice having you, y'all. Yeah. Welcome you. to Tusco's Court. Um, yeah. But what are you doing, Beast? I was doing. Ah, yeah, Durban is cool, man. I mean, Durban is unearthing talent. I believe like now is a very important time yeah. for Durban. So yeah, I mean, it's cool. It's just that obviously some opportunities come later than they would if you were. I've actually just been looking, man. Like, in fact, we actually did a thing about it, like the Slick on Life recently. Like, we, we were looking at the fact that, like, yo, most of the artists that are doing a lot in the industry right now yeah. are coming from Durban. Mm. Um, what do you think is causing that, you know? particular atmosphere, what makes you guys have that particular edge in hip-hop? And it's not just in hip-hop because even in house yeah. and all these other areas. Uh, I think it's just more exposed now. I mean, yeah. for, for quite a long time, it, that has been the case where uh, like artists who come from outside of uh, yeah. uh, Joburg to be specific, yeah. um, not taking anything away from the Joe we're yeah, born yeah, at, but yeah. a lot of talent comes from outside of the city, yeah. into the city. So it's just that I feel like it's a wave right now where yeah, the yeah. majority like is yeah. coming from <laughs> Joe. Yeah, yeah, but Jay, no, I'm and I'm saying are putting in a lot of work. Yeah, that's that's one thing I think they've realized. Uti, the doors wide open. Yeah. Uh, to get it, you gotta go in, yeah. and they're doing just that, and yeah. Yeah, it's coming right. Yeah. So um, the last time you were here, you know, you dropped uh, you dropped an EP. Yeah. Um, Cold Rock Pardon. Yeah. Okay. Um, and you basically, you know, we're talking about during those periods the fact that you know you, you hadn't been dropping music before. Yeah. You dropped the project. You know, you're ready to run with it. Yeah. But then you know, it's been a year. It's, it's been a, a year. It's been a year. Um, uh, what's what's been going down musically? Um, a lot, actually. I've, I've yeah. been recording a lot of music. Yeah. The reason why I haven't dropped a project yet is I, I, I stumbled on this clip yeah. where uh, it was Jimmy Iovine explaining yeah. that deadlines yeah. kill creativity. Damn, yeah. You know, yeah. so yeah. sometimes I feel like, well, most recently I feel like I want to drop something I'm 100% happy with. Yeah. I've got music, yeah. but I don't necessarily have a project because yeah. I want to theme the project. The, the music must tell a story when played track after track after track after yeah. track. So I will definitely be releasing soon. Another thing that's obviously been, been keeping me busy is the gom side of Beast. Which is <laughs> we're going there, we're going there. <laughs> but yeah, which yeah, is, yeah, which, yeah. Which is just crazy, like how it all unwind, yeah. unwinded. But yeah, man, it's it's not a case where I'm not in studio. It's not a case where uh, I don't I don't think I'm yeah. gonna drop or no, yeah. I'm definitely gonna drop. Yeah, and also yeah. I, I think his fans were pretty spoiled, right? Like <laughs> like, like, like we're kind of like we're always like, I right, cool, we've heard this, we like it. Now we want more. Yeah, like Queen's more coming, and you know. Sometimes you gotta let the artists actually have the process and yeah. work on it, and you know. Another, another reason actually was that I'm so ghetto. Only started gaining traction late last year. Another joint, bro. You know, so yeah, and and actually here in Joburg, surprisingly, the, like the bigger radio stations are only picking it up now. Yeah, which yeah. now puts me yeah. in an awkward position because yeah. I'm trying yeah. to move on. But, yeah. yeah, you know, so I've been dabbling with ideas of features, um, a lot of. Uh, our big, big cats are, are, are harder in that game. Fits. Yeah. This joint is the one. If yeah. you ever want to do a remix, nice the one. Yeah, well. right, that right yeah. the one. Yeah. So it's it's a lot of factors, obviously, that a person from the outside won't see yeah. if nobody tells them. Yeah. But yeah, man. Is that the reason you chose to actually release the music video this year? Or uh, was that already just part of the plan? But it's it's only now that people are actually paying attention to it. Uh, not really. Uh, well, I only shot the video yeah. after selecting it as a single, okay. which was late in the year. So we had trouble getting it onto TV uh, during okay. that period of the festive, you know. Yeah. So that's why it only dropped in January. Uh, okay. Yeah. So that that was the the, the reason. Yeah. It wasn't really the plan to to cross over like that. Yeah. 
So yeah, you're talking about the calm side of, of, of beast. Yo, yeah, man, what, what's, what's going on? Because I saw, you know, you got a joint with, uh, with Dira, yeah. you know, um, and it, it seems like it's what you Devon guys are doing, right? Like Dash is also like dropping some gom stuff. Is it, is, is it that Beast now is also doing gom or what's going, what's going down? Yeah. For me, it was crazy because I just dropped a freestyle. Really? Yeah, I dropped that was a, a free. freestyle and yeah. Dira posted it yeah. and kind of went viral. And then we ah, hit the okay. studio, and ah, okay, okay, okay. I was names, Dira and Tipsy. Ah, okay. So that's how the song Pampa came about. And then, but what the song did, because the people loved it so much, yeah. attracted other Gorm artists to yeah. call me up, like, right now, yeah. let's collab. Let's. Yeah. So you will be seeing a lot of Beast in the Gorm market, but it's it, it's not necessarily that I've left hip hop. I, I can't leave hip hop. Yeah. I don't think it's even possible yeah. to leave hip hop for me. So yeah, yeah but we got another song coming with Tira. Yeah. I did something with uh, Mampi in Chanumbu so at West Inc. Yeah. Uh, I'm in talks yeah. or yeah. Like there's a lot of people that are looking to work. And yeah. I, I'm not gonna shut anybody out. So basically, we must just expect a wave of gone. Yeah, and, and, and it's beyond my control. Yeah, you know I mean, because yeah. what it does for me is it, it it sends me on the road. Yeah. So when I'm on the road, I get to showcase my hip hop. Yeah. Before yeah. I do the gom stuff, you know. Yeah. So yeah. it's it's it, it still works for me. Yeah. You know? yeah. yeah. And, and I think also, I mean, it, I mean, hip hop is not a genre that is boxed in. Really. Yeah, people are able to like yeah. jump into, you know, other genres of music and still come back to their core in terms of definitely in, ter in terms of hip hop. Definitely. Um, yeah. So this year, you know, you come out, you say, "Yo, man, this is the your beast." Right? Yeah. You know. Um, what, just, just just take us through what you actually mean by that. So this is the year of beast. This is the year. <laughs> Yeah. It's crazy because, like in January, it was just a thing. Like, yeah. actually, this is the year. Yeah. And there were there wasn't really specific factors to justify it, but yeah. it was a law of attraction type of thing. Yeah. Like, okay, I'm I'm attracting this. Yeah. Yes. This is the into year. Into yeah. What what you want to see happening? Exactly. Into existence. Yeah. Yes. Yeah. Like this is gonna happen this yeah. year. And so far, so good. Yeah, it's happened. Now I just need to end off with a clout. Yeah. And it's mission accomplished. Is, is, is there any hip-hop music coming? Yeah. Project? Yeah, I'm, I'm, I'm dropping a single like in a few weeks. In a few weeks? Yeah. Um, what's it called, bro? Yeah. <laughs> a new name? The, the, on it? The, you know what the yeah. crazy thing is? <laughs> that like I'm so happy with my music that I'm not even sure which one to drop. Oh, okay. So, so there's a lot of them. Yeah, there's, there's yeah. options and yeah. yeah. Uh, this this week I'm going to be uh, finishing up with a couple of features. Yeah. And then then I have solid tracks and be able to choose. But which, which, before which the end of this month, you should have something new. Something new. Yeah, I'm, I'm going to the studio with uh, Cool Cat. Yeah. Uh, just as soon as recently as yesterday, I sent something to Questa. Yeah. So you know. Some crazy features are on the yeah, definitely. Yeah. Um, definitely. Do, you, do you have a name for the project yet? Yeah. I don't. You don't? I don't, actually. Which is very funny, because that's where I usually start. The Year of the Beast. <laughs> the Year of the Beast. <laughs> are we? Are we? Are we? <laughs> it could work. Could yeah, work. Could work, right? It could work. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Um, yeah, man, um, I've just been, you know, listening to, you know, that project, you know. The, yeah a rock bottom um, and I've been listening to you know the sound that you were doing there there was a bit of you know some trap vibes you know there's a lot of different sound elements that are in there yeah um, how would you define Beast's sound like your sound mm. and uh, should we expect something similar on this project do should we expect a lot of experimentation what, 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 what should we expect well on all my projects I've always had different sounds yeah so you definitely pick up more or less, not necessarily the same sound, but the same approach. Okay. You know, where where it's a variety, because I've always I've always been the type of guy that wants to have a project that 
a whole family can listen to. Yeah. Even if they break it down into segments. Yeah. yeah where it's yeah. okay, after track five, Ma, leave the room. It's about to get here, you know? Yeah. Yeah. And things like that. And and surprisingly I've always been able to achieve it. Yeah. Obviously, through working with people that understand me, yeah. people like Oh Lasty, yeah. you know, uh, who's, who's always like headed the engineering yeah. part of my project. Yeah. So, you definitely get a little bit of something for everyone. Yeah. And then, um, yeah, man, just more fire, yeah. more fire, way more fire than than ever before. I always strive to to drop something harder than my previous project because people yeah. always ask me. I'm fine. You will never top this one. Yeah. How will you top yeah. this? You know. So yeah. I'm always beating myself, sleepless nights, pushing myself to the to the edge, just to achieve that. Do you have like I know you've already mentioned Questa and all these things. Um, do you have any other features that are on there that you like people to know about, or that are still coming? Um, well, I can I can. You know, I can definitely guarantee people like your tribals. Yeah, yeah, your yeah. Lasties, I, I, yeah, you know. yeah, yeah, yeah. Now nah, uh, you should have one. He, he, yeah, last yeah. Season, yeah, yeah, definitely. Yeah. And then like people like your your, your teller man, if he's not busy, because obviously he's also working on something right now. Yeah. Which is why we haven't really had the opportunity to work on anything at all. Yeah. But it's just been a discussion that no man, whenever we get time, let's do something. Yeah, because he's one of the people I, I've been working with for the longest time. So it, 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 it feels awkward for me not to have anything yeah. with him. I mean, it's not a bad thing, but you know, yeah. if, if, yeah. if the chance avails, yeah. we definitely go for it. Yeah, yeah, man, um, just as, as a final question, I actually wanted to ask this because I was just looking online and I was like, yo, because the first time I know about you, mm -hmm. legit, I know about you from um, where the brand at. Yeah. Like that was that was the first time I got to know about yeah. you straight. And then I was just looking and researching and stuff. I'm like, yo, this guy's been at this yeah. Yeah. for a minute. <laughs> yeah. And um, where, where would you place, where would you, oh, I mean, it's almost as if we could, we, we, we could even say like, you know, I mean, you've been there. I mean, I think there's a line on one of your songs where you even talk about the fact that, you know, you, you were rapping while El Tito was still, yeah. like, you know, the, the pushing Glitz gang. gang. Pushing Glitz Gang, yeah. yeah. Um, where, where would you place yourself, like, in the game? Where, 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 where do you, what position do you, do you, do you feel you're at? Um, I mean, I feel, I feel like uh, I'm yet to pop off. Okay. But I'm definitely not a newcomer. Yeah, because I've 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 ran the road, I've I've learned a lot yeah. from working Namachita, who are already established. I've yeah. worked with a lot of big names, yeah. Like yeah. super big. Yeah. Um, but resource-wise, I couldn't really get my music to reach the the, the market as it was intended for. Mm. You know, mm. but for me, it's not a bad thing because a lot of people now go back. Yeah, yeah, you know, yeah. and and search. Like the other day, I was at a petrol station, yeah. and this guy comes up to me, who works there. I say, "Vana, Joe, some guy played me your stuff from 2012, dog. Yeah, please, can I have that project?" Yeah. I'm like, "Yo, Vana, even I don't have that project." <laughs> <laughs> yeah, he's like, "Yo, that's some hard stuff. You know, if you could re-release, you know, he's talking about all that that type of stuff, because I've always aimed to make." Timeless music. Yeah, it's not like yeah. you listen to rock bottom yeah, in yeah. four years' time and be like, "Yo, this sounds so old school." Yeah, it, yeah. it doesn't. Yeah. Like it's so much that some people actually even try to fund me yeah. to re-release re and repackage. Yeah. You know? So I, I, I feel like I just see myself as a, a, an experienced bubbling under. Yeah, you know. Yeah, I think that's that's, that's the that's best it, way to describe it because yeah. I can't call myself a newcomer, can't call myself a rookie. Yeah. Uh, yeah. But I can't say I've made it at yeah. the same time. You know, it's yeah. just experience. Yeah. Yeah. Yo, man. Um. Um. I I I'll certainly come out and say that yo, you've got some really dope work. Um, Thank you. Bro. Um. I mean, you're one of the select few. Whether you go in the neck, whether you go in English, bulala <laughs> 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 Yeah. <laughs> But yeah, man, um, thank you very much for pulling up. Um, thank and you, And let us know, man, when the project drops. Of course. Yeah. Uh, 
and if, it's the, and if it's that name, you know, them royalties, my nigga. <laughs> yeah, yeah the beast. Yeah, the beast. Yeah, I know, but I'm, I'm gonna wrap up soon. I need to, I need to wrap up. I also feel the pressure on myself. Like, yeah. I, I like having new music out yeah. all the time, but it's obvious, obviously the struggles, like I'm telling you, some people will say, no, but you can't just close the chapter when you've got so much quality. Yeah, yeah. You still got a couple of singles. Shout out, my G. Thank, Thank you, you for so much. Up. Thank you so much. Showcase. Broadcast live.